doing it. As many of you may know, I love trying new things, and I also love learning about different cultures and people. Naturally, the best way to do this is to try candy from all over the world. I made a video where I tried candy from Finland. You can watch it right here. It went really well, and it even made it onto a Finnish news site, which is crazy. It's absurd, but the coolest thing ever. In the comments of that video, you guys gave me loads of great suggestions on what parts of the world I should try some candy from. So in today's video, that is exactly what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to be trying candy from Mexico! By the way, this is a super tiny pinata. Look how cute it is! What should I do with it? Let me know in the comment section below. My friend Layla came with me to St. Louis to a Mexican supermarket where I got loads of really cool snacks to try in today's video. You can watch the vlog where we went to the supermarket right here. Just click here and it'll take you over to my second channel where I post daily vlogs, which you should go check out. Definitely. They're awesome. Now, I love Mexican food, but I've never really had Mexican candy or snacks quite like this, so I'm really excited. Let's start with this one. This is called Lucas Bombasso. Not only can I not speak Finnish, I can't speak Spanish, so I will probably be butchering most of these names. My apologies in advance. We're gonna start with this one because it has a duck that is clearly losing its mind on it. He's like, oh my god. So I'm a bit nervous. Is it gonna be super spicy? Is it gonna be like crazy? I don't know. Look at him. He's freaking out. Lemon flavored hot candy with chewing gum. Okay, let's do it. Whoa. Oh my god. What? What is this? I was not, I don't even, okay, so I don't know if you can see this. It's like a sticky red substance. How much should I do? It smells awful. <laughs> it smells so bad. Okay, I'm gonna go all out. Let's do this. Oh, God. So many things. So many things are happening. No. Oh. That is so confusing and so weird. It tastes lemony, but it's also hot. No, I'm, no. Oh my gosh. I can't give this anything. I don't, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. The second thing I'm gonna try also has a duck on it. Apparently, big fans of ducks in Mexico. I don't know, but this one is so cute. And he's so happy and excited, so this has to be good. It looks like some sort of sponge cakes with like chocolate on it. Oh, it smells good. It just looks like a little cake. That's fine. It's just like a chocolate covered sponge cake. Mm, and there's like some cream and some jelly. You get four out of five stars. Good job. Next, we have something called sweet tamarind candy. I don't know what tamarind is. I got a lot of snacks that are tamarind flavored and I don't know what it is. I'm assuming it's like a fruit. These look super appetizing. They really do. A lot of sugar. It's like really sour, but it's covered in sugar. It kind of tastes like that first one I had. Oh, I don't like this. But it's one of those things where I don't like it, but I want it. I want another bite. Yeah. It's all in sugar. I'm gonna give you a one. Mmm, no more. Mm -mm. Alright, let's just get all this tamarind out of the way. Woohoo! Pul pulperindo? It's hot and salted tamarind pulp candy. Salted? Why are we salting things? Oh my gosh, this is like a salty licorice flashback. Oh, I'm really nervous about this. Oh god. Salty, all right. Whoa, wow, okay. It all tastes hot and lemony. I don't know. Okay, this one is actually not bad. When you first bite into it, it's kind of like sweet and salty, and then the hotness hits you in the end and you have like a burning tongue sensation aftertaste. I'll give you like a two. You're all right, all right. Speaking of tamarind, we have a soda. Natural flavored soda made of tamarind. What is tamarind? Cheers. That's actually pretty good. That's not bad. I give you four. Four stars. I have ta takis? Takis? I don't know. Basically, they're chips. This chip flavor is explosion. So that's gonna be intense. These are essentially cheese and chili pepper tortilla chips. Woo! They're like rolled and you can tell this is gonna be hot. You can tell this is gonna be so hot. Oh! <laughs> Yeah, it's pretty hot. Oh man. I don't handle heat very well and oh my god. It's one of those where like it's, it's really hot and everything but they're good and you just want to keep eating. 
I like these. I like these a lot. I'm gonna get. Oh my goodness, guys, this is so hot. I'm gonna give you a four and a half. All right, I have my final Mexican candy item, and this is a sucker called Rebena. Rabanaditas? A hard candy lollipop. Watermelon flavored with chili powder. Oh, this looks so appetizing. Oh my goodness. Yummy. Whoa. I'm gonna go with no. Wow, it was quite, I gotta get that taste out of my mouth. <laughs> well, there you go, guys. That was just some of the Mexican candy that I was able to get a hold of. I'm sure there are lots of other great candies out there. If you know of some, let me know in the comment section below and I'll try to find them. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a giant thumbs up. And if you like these videos where I try candies or foods from different parts of the world, I will link a bunch at the end of this video and in the description box below. Also, where should I try candy from next? I'm currently working on two other videos where I've tried different candies, one of which is gonna be from like Japan, Taiwan, Thailand, and the other one is gonna be a whole bunch of British sweets. So look forward to seeing those in the near future. Thanks for watching, I'll see you later. Bye. Oh, oh, so many things are happening. Ah, oh, no, I don't know what's happening in my mouth right now. It's like toothpaste with salt.